We've come a long way since the Magnavox Odyssey, or as some called it, the Brown Box in 1972. 47 years later, gaming has taken on a whole new life. Athletes getting paid for their skills, and as Matt McCloak explains, it's even giving people the chance to pay for their education. These Grandview University students are expanding the definition of what many consider to be a student athlete. I think the actual hours we put into the game probably exceeds a traditional athlete by a pretty wide margin. Video games have become much more than just a hobby with the rapid growth and popularity of esports. Esports is the online competitive world of gaming. The World Cup is the only thing that beats in viewership. Three or four years ago, people would have thrown you out for trying to make a, a guess like that. It's pretty big. So big that your kid's favorite athlete may not even pick up a ball but instead a controller. Obviously we know Ninja now is the most famous athlete in the world over LeBron James right now. Isn't that crazy? Who would have thought a video game streamer who plays Fortnite would be doing that? But eSports isn't just growing on the professional level. It's also now gaining traction collegiately. Over here, we're going to be coming into our uh, varsity space. We have our varsity Overwatch. We'll be sitting here as well as our varsity League of Legends. Grandview is paving the way for college esports in Iowa. They were the first to make it a sanctioned sport and also the first to offer scholarships for gamers. And initially, I was like turned off to going to school because I was like, why would I do that? Like, I know where my career path is and I can do that now. But then they were like, hey, we can convince you to come here and have a career path that's a little bit more secure. And that plus a scholarship will get you to go anywhere, probably. Well, say you have a League of Legends tournament um, and you win $10,000. It gets divided into six, and that money will go back to the student account. Uh, it's not, a, not just cash in their pocket. It's for them to pay off their bill at Grandview. These student athletes put in a minimum of 18 hours of team practice a week. And the results show. Grandview was ranked 27th in ESPN's Week 1 College Esport Rankings. That was really exciting, too, for us, um, especially with the size that, that Grandview is. And all the while getting more out of gaming than they ever thought possible through esports. It's being used to develop people outside of the top of the top. Um, just as people. It's just like any other athlete. You are here to go to school and get your degree and graduate from here to be something bigger and better. And this is just something that they can live out their passion to doing video gaming. In Des Moines, Matt McCulloch, Local 5 Sports. So I can get we are Iowa.